Welcome back to Dude Let's Play. Yeah, Max. Pain. Uh, bring in the pain. Uh. Just bring in the pain. That's it. I thought for sure there were bad guys up here. That was pretty sweet. Nope. He's got to have fucking killer calf workouts. Bad guys, bad guys, huh? Bad guys? Uh, hey, bad guys. Get your bad guys over here. That's how you jump. I almost fucked up jumping. I've seen you fuck up jumping multiple times. What's going on here? News. Yeah, I think that's what wants me to look at, but I'm checking it. Dirty dishes. Uh, what's going on in the news? Uh, we got a vigilante Max Payne. Max Payne has nowhere left to go. We are very close to capturing him. You'll get a full statement then. Right now, I've got better things to do, ma'am. That was Deputy Chief Jim Brevera from the NYPD with no further comment at this time. Apart from his suspicious food habits, I figured Bravora to be one of the good guys. Fate had just dropped us on different sides in this. But when it came to capturing me, he was way out of his league. I had already ditched the cops a couple of rooftops back. For now. Damn. Max Payne, you obey this. Something like that. Oh, shit. Man, just taking people's Advil and shit. That's fucked up. Oh, oh good! You got some... You got a shoddy. Oh, fuck! Man, this game looks decent. Oh, fuck! Oh, explosions. Oh, oh, God. Uh, uh. I guess apparently, if you have no slow-mo, you just do a normal dodge roll. You can run out of slow-mo? Yeah. Thank God. Oh, fuck you, dude. That's some intense shit for me. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, jeez. Fucking throwing grenades recklessly. Man. Where is this? Brooklyn? Open, God damn it! Is this gonna be the showdown? Pretty sure, because nobody's opening the door. Kill you, you lousy freaking cop. It's okay. He's missing fingers because he's had to have shot him off by now. Whoa, the fuck? Damn, man. You're just tearing them up. Everything's going so blurry. Getting blurry. <laughs> like he had no idea you were back there. Hey, where the fuck that guy? <laughs> Man, you've got to be bruised up all over by now. Just throwing yourself at people like that. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam! Is that the guy? Yep. Yeah. Nice, he's dead. Fucking motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. Piece of shit. Story mode complete. Just kidding. They threw so many guys at me, I don't remember that part. Gagnotti ran, ran out of steam in a dead and dead alley with steam boiling out of the sewer. Brain like all the fires of hell were burning high beneath us. Are you a voice actor? Yep. Piece of shit. Jealous? <laughs> no. Just Where's Lupino? Where's Lupino? Oh yeah. Bad thing. I rate pretty high on that. You can't just hurt me in cold blood? Yeah, I kind of sound like him. Kind of. I'm not going to be anybody's fall guy. I'm not gonna be anybody's fall guy. Oh, that was him. Yeah. Very bad annotations there. Yeah, they were kind of bad. They were kind of close to. There was no glory. What in the this. fuck? I hadn't asked for this crap. Trouble had come. I hadn't asked for this fucking, fucking shit. The good and the just were like gold dust in the city. I had no illusions. I was not one of them. I was no hero. Just me. And Man, the, and the, the guy that created the this game thinks really highly of himself, course. making the game based off his own body. I'm telling you, it's probably to save money. Because in the second and third one, they don't do that. Rockstar doesn't need to save money. This was like a long ass time ago. Before or after San Andreas? This was before San Andreas. This was like right around Grand Theft Auto 3. No. Yeah. Because no. Because no. No, look it up. It was probably after Grand Theft Auto 3, but I'm saying, like... This is 2001. Ragnarok was Lupino's private nightclub. Mm. A den of drugs built into an old theater. 
I knew what waited inside. V had junkies ready to explode. Okay, after I beat this, this is the end of the first day. Oh, this is like a fucking boss battle, kinda. Well, I mean, like, Lupino was kind of a boss battle, too. And that dude with his pants right down was kind of a boss battle. <laughs> oh. That was intense, then. Belly of the nightclub was a gothic theme park that began Just like that circus. And led to the nasty stuff <laughs> from there. Okay, it was before San Andreas, but only by three years. So it was still in the same time room of Vice City. It was before Vice City. <sighs> now you're making me look up Vice City. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it was before Vice okay, City. Okay, it was a year before Vice City, but exactly. still. They weren't like the huge powerhouse yet. Oh. I mean, like, Grand Theft Auto 3, like, definitely helped them with that, but... I don't want to hear it. I want to see you beat this game. Get your tickets here. Get your security here. Get your tickets. Okay, I remember. There's a story here. Yeah, you gotta get your tickets, man. Yeah. Get a... What did I just open up? Um, it's closed. You opened up the security door side? Nope. I'm wrong. Oh, nice. Oh, shit. Uh... Man, this is bad. There's a oh, door behind me. Oh, you open the door behind the tickets. Oh, yeah. Time to fucking shoot people. Oh, it could never been a bestseller. Given the I don't know about you. I just want to see Kyrie. some fucking tandem Maybe train flips again. <laughs> that was pretty great. <laughs> That is the best thing. <laughs> you could tell they just used the exact same animation for both of the character models. I just like the fact that I do bleeding out like did that. <laughs> In fact, I'm pretty sure they used the exact same animation for both scenes. Like, oh, one just has blood all over. One has the cats up. Oh shit, someone's whistling. Get the whistle. Oh! Did he just throw a grenade? Man, that is very instinctive of that guy just to throw a grenade <laughs> at whoever like, what wants. What happens if his pal wasn't like. What if that was like his wife and kids, like, hey, honey, we brought you some luck. <laughs> oh god, there's two families we killed today. Dance, be the DJ. Fucking, fucking, fucking Max Payne. Family's dead. Gonna <laughs> kill the guy. Bring him in dead. Cause uh, my family's dead, and I'm just angry. Cause my family's dead. Oh shit! Man, okay. that was pretty good. I didn't know that was there. Oh, to the disco, baby. What? The man, that guy is just as good as me at dodge rolling. Oh man. It's a party in here. Oh shit! I didn't even have to slow mo that time. That was the first. Oh, I did not mean for to a second. Kills. The game looked decent. This game is good, even with the dodge rolling all the time. Just trying to see if I can find any drugs. Yeah, probably. Looking for them drugs to ease my pain. Max Payne the killer, Max Payne the game. Oh. Bam. Flies <laughs> like 10 feet back. Books on the occult have been <laughs> This seems like a cult. Am I just not. Am I being oblivious? Or does it look like there's like a cult going on in this club? Yeah, that's kind of what's going on. Like the, the dude who runs. I didn't want to say anything when I first seen like the fucking pentagram <laughs> in the first room, or the pentagram in the second room. <laughs> but now that there's blood and skulls and shit on the wall, I'm kind of like, okay, there's an underlining thing here. <laughs> I'm like, man, this fucking party's getting crazy. Fucking sheep blood and shit. 
Oh shit. Just want to let you know, every time I play this mission, there's one point in this game where I get lost and I don't know where to go. <laughs> and then I have to like spend like five minutes figuring it out. That's like every day of my life. <laughs> I kind of just like wake up and I'm like, oh fuck, now where do I go? Oof. Do you ever like just sleep so good you wake up and you're like, oh fuck. Reality's back. You kind of just like want to just go back to sleep. It happens when I have like fucking wet dreams. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hoping you're talking about peeing the bed. <laughs> Not that kind of wet dream. Man, everybody's dead. All my friends are dead. Is this the point where you get lost? No, I just want to make sure I don't miss any, like, painkillers or dumb shit like that. Well, let's just take those drugs, man. They're probably hardcore. <laughs> uh, trust me, sometimes this shit, I do take those drugs, and it's not fun. Not fun for max pain. So there's a part in this game where you can, like, take those drugs? Well, you basically get drugged. Oh, so there's like a drug to level? Yeah, and it's terrible, and I hate it. <laughs> That's the message, kids. Don't do drugs. Just play games that you do drugs in. And you'll hate it. Yes. Oh! Ugh. Big mistake, man! Blood everywhere! That guy looks like Steve Buscemi. Yeah. Okay. Just fucking killed Steve Buscemi, man. That guy's deadly accurate. Just like you. He doesn't have slow mo like I do. <laughs> I just imagine you're like closing your eyes, turning your head, <laughs> and just like running into rooms, just like <laughs> simultaneously like raising your hands up and down, shooting. I wish you could like check out your character model, like you know, rotate the camera and see if it's just Max Payne always with like this <laughs> eyes closed, <laughs> fucking. Scrunched oh god, face. here I go again. <laughs> Playing some eighties music. Here I go again. Walk down on the road. He ever know. Does anyone to go here? No. Oh fuck that! Jump, 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 jump. Nope, you gotta go that way. Oh nice. Oh shit. You're getting shot at. Oh, you're dead. Ooh. Ow. Nuts on the drugs. Oh, you killed everyone down there. That's what I thought. Maybe one dude came back. Ragnarok. I hope I don't have to play like all that over again. Well, nope. That's not too bad. Right? I don't even remember. What would Dino we can I say put anything. it off to the next episode. Next episode. Of do let fucking play Max Payne. Yeah. Bam. Damn. <laughs>